what is going on you guys man uh i would have this video would have been i would have done this a lot soon uh soon i was trying to say sooner and earlier but a lot earlier if i didn't fall asleep i fell asleep like five six in the morning when i was trying no actually no i fell asleep at like seven or eight in the morning and i tried to stay up as much as i could but i guess i just knocked out and uh, i just now finished getting all the costumes so yeah uh in this order we're gonna go we're gonna go nia zeke morag poppy i mean poppy tora and then rex so I'll just, uh, you know, just like I did the uh, last time, I'll just show the outfits and then, you know, we'll say what I got to say. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. So Nia's is called Blood Witch Nia. Improves the effect of healing arts by 24%. Not gonna lie, it looks pretty cool. Okay, let's go ahead and check out Joe Marks. I am at your service. They look very nice together. Now, Dromarks is a uh, uh, Dromarks is called Obsidian Dromark. Reduces aggro drawn from specials and driver arts by fifteen percent. Now, before you ask, yes, these are DLC outfits. You have to buy the expansion pass, okay? Don't start asking me, how do you get these? Okay, moving on. Let's go ahead and get uh, Zeke in here. Okay, Zeke is called Shining Justice Zeke. Increases critical damage by 50%. And then Pandoria's is called Magical Pink Pandoria. Increases damage dealt by 50% when affinity is at max. We'll take a look at Pandoria first. Look, you can see her eyes. Yeah, there you go. Dab on them. Dab on them haters. I like Pandoria's. It's pretty cute. Zeke's is alright, I guess. Okay, very nice. Let's go ahead and get a uh, Morag and Bridget in here. Morag's is called Scarlet Inquisitor Morag. Boost de boost dexterity by thirty two percent. And then Bridget is called Emerald Empress Bridget. This was it should have been called a monolith. I don't know why you didn't do it. You should have taken my advice. But instead, it's called Crimson Crimson Orchid Bridget. Increases evasion rate by 16% when affinity is at max. I'm telling you, Emerald Empress sounds a lot better than Crimson Orchid. Oh, wait. That's definitely the wrong ox cord. <laughs> 
Jade Orchid Bridget. <laughs> Oh, you can't really see more eggs. Oh, there you go. It's red. That's all you need to know. It's red. Bridget, though. Very nice. I'm telling you, Emerald Empress Bridget would have been a lot nicer. That would have been a better name. Hey! More eggs is pretty cool. It's just a different. It's just a different color. I know all of them are just reskin colors, but you, you know you know what I mean. It's nothing. It's not like a hatless morag, but it's still pretty nice though. Okay, very nice. Moving on to Tora. Okay, I hear. It. The Torah gets one, it's called Skullface Punk Torah. Now, believe it or not, the poppies also get new outfits. Now, you, you can purchase them just like normal, just like you can buy the other ones, but once you buy them, you gotta go to the poppy swap and go to skill upgrade, and then you select the one that pertains to them. So, Nano Orange Cutie Pie, Antique Princess Poppy Cutie, Cornflower Poppy Alpha. So they already have theirs. I'll just cycle through them so that you can see. We'll go ahead and put the, uh, we'll put Alpha first. Poppy will guard you again. And then Cutie and then, uh. Poppy will guard you again. Cutie Pie will be last. He looks like a little panda. Oh, look at the little wheel on his chest. It has a skull in the middle. Then we got Alpha doing her thing. Pretty cute, pretty cute. All right, moving on to QT. Hey. Oh, you see that the the mini jiggle physics. <laughs> pretty cute, pretty cute outfit. Oh, there you go. Get it, girl. Strut your stuff. Very nice. Okay. Let's go ahead and move on to Puppy Cutie Pie. Ooh, she looking like Tony the Tiger, too. Why is everybody trying to look like Tony the Tiger? Hold on, girl. Come in. Let's, let's get you in the light. There we go. Ooh. Yes, get it. That's right. She knows what's up. But there you go, Puppy Cutie Pie. Very nice. Let's go ahead and. Uh, Get a little, little back shot. New day. Back shot. 
Okay. So there you have it. Tora and the Boppies get new outfits. Okay, moving on to Rex. Now, Rex is called Cloud Sea King Rex. Adds a 60% chance of attacking again after a successful auto attack. So it's like the Galaxy Cube, pretty much. Okay, Pyra also gets one. Hers is called Blue Sky Pyra. Boosts critical hit rate by 20%. Mithra also gets one. It's called Carbon Mithra. Increases blade combo damage by 30%. Now, I'm going to tell you something. You guys know that Pyra is my waifu, okay? Without a doubt. But in this DLC, the outfits, Mithra wins. She is the best one, hands down. You can't even find me. Don't add me. So we'll save her for last. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at Rex and Pyra. Pyra takes on the colors of Numa, is what it seems like. I don't know where else you could get this from, but she starts to look like Numa. And then Rex, eh, Rex is okay, I guess. Nothing special, to be honest. Pyra, on the other hand. Ooh, she looking nice. She still looks nice. It just though it just so happens that Mithra wins this time. Ooh. Okay. Let's go ahead and switch over to Mithra. All right, you guys ready for this? I don't think you're ready for the greatness that is Mithra's color scheme. All right, here you go. Back to our emo days. Ooh. Rex, could you get out the way? Where did she go? Mithra, come back! What? Oh, oh, okay. So you can just... Alright. You think you can just act innocently and you'll be alright. Well, you know what? You're absolutely right. Wait, the sun's not hitting you. Here. There you go. Dang, that's that's very that's pretty cool. But yeah, you guys, that was it for the uh, showcase. Yeah. <laughs> As always, thanks for watching the vi thanks for watching the video. Thanks for checking it out. As always. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.